What's up everybody? Welcome to my channel. I've been wanting to do this for a decent amount of time now. Finally built up the courage to do it. So welcome to my channel. It's gonna kind of be just uh, not necessarily a vlog channel, but I would say just kind of like this video specifically will be a day in a life. So I just woke up, it is 9.14 in the morning on a Sunday. Just woke up, about to go hit the gym, hit some legs, got my gym gym clothes on, got my, my short shorts for legs. Short shorts are necessary for leg days. <laughs> but yeah, um, this first video, day in life. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, let's make some pre-workout. Alani New is a pre-workout I use. I really like the Hawaiian shaved ice. That's what this is. This is probably my favorite flavor. I used to use C4, but this does it for me now. It's a lot better. <laughs> Workouts made. Alrighty, I'm in the car now, about to go to the gym, like I said, gonna hit legs. I'm gonna start off with squats, gonna go to some leg press, do some lunges, and then do some calves, because you can't skip calves. Pretty simple stuff today. Um, I'm not really gonna talk in between the workouts, I'm just gonna kind of record on what I'm doing, but my, I'm gonna eat a Rice Krispie Treat right before. The reason I do is because uh, Rice Krispie Treats are really easy to digest for your stomach so it gets you some uh, carbs kind of like right away and that really helps you uh, stay energized through your workout. So yeah, next couple clips is going to be my workout. Hope you guys enjoy.
got back from the gym, hit legs. We got soaked on the way to the car because it's pouring. But we're gonna head to Walmart. Uh, we're gonna get some tortillas because we are making quesadillas. And if you guys don't know what that is, that's basically a taco with shredded beef onto it with a crap ton of cheese. And it's got the consume, which is basically kind of the sauce of the beef. Don't judge me, I think it's called consume. But we're gonna get some avocados too to make some aguacate. Some, how do you say it in English? Aguacate, wow, I'm having a brain fart. Avocados, no guac. <laughs> gonna make some guac. Uh, gonna go to Walmart, get some tortillas, head back home, and then trying to kind of show you how you make some quesadillas. All right. I might look a little weird because I'm wearing gloves. That's because I just got home and we're making, we're prepping everything for the um, quesadillas. And I'm taking the seeds out of these chiles. And I was prompted to wear gloves because I don't wanna to touch my face with the seeds, but go ahead and judge me. I'm wearing surgical gloves. I'm doing surgery on the chiles to remove the seeds, but we're gonna get everything prepped and I'm gonna kinda do bits and pieces of what we're doing just so you, so, so you can kinda see how, how they're made. Yeah, let's do this. All right, we got the chiles boiling. About to get the meat on there to get a good color on it. I wash my hands, I promise. Ooh, this might not fit the pan. Then we let that sear for five minutes on each side before I put it into the crock pot and let it cook for about eight hours. Ooh wee, we got the chiles boiling, we got the meat, and then we're gonna set it up in the crock pot here soon. That <laughs> definitely does not fit that pan, that's funny. Alrighty, everything is made, we even made our breakfast, which is, it's like a, Chorizo, chorizo with eggs, beans, and potatoes. <laughs> okay, so now we have our meat over here for our quesadillas. We're gonna be cooking this on high for about four to six hours. And yeah, I'm so excited to try this. Last time we did it, it was we cooked it for, I think about one hour. We did it the fast way, but this time we're letting it do it, doing it the slow way. So I'll let you know how it turns out. All right, just finished up having breakfast. Um, this video is supposed to be like a day in the life, like I said in the beginning, but my Sundays consist of working out in the morning, having breakfast, and then doing homework for the rest of the day. And I don't think you guys want to see me do homework, just sit here and do homework. So, the ending of the video is going to be me showing you the result of our quesadillas. So, yeah, um, I didn't realize how hard it was to film at the gym. So those angles that you're going to be seeing, I'll try and get better at them. <clears throat> it's just my first time actually like recording myself for a long period of time at the gym. So sorry about the angles. But yeah, um, I'm going to hit the shower get started on homework and hearing about the meat's cooking right now for our dinner so here in about four hours um i'll give you an update of how it ended up turning out we are back guys finished product here you have it got the shredded beef normally it's a lot more cheese than this but we don't want to have we don't want it to be too cheesy. You're probably wondering what's in the coffee cup. This is the consume. I'm not gonna really tilt it. You can kind of see it. I'm supposed to dip the taco into here. Get a nice little. Now let's try it. Oh. 
A bomb. Yeah. So this first video is kind of all over the place. As video as I keep making more, it'll be a little more a little better. Transitions will be a little better, but hope you guys enjoyed the first video and see you in the second. Peace.